Right now at 11, a driver ambushed at a gas station. It's a frightening example of how the carjacking crisis continues to grow in Philadelphia. Good evening, I'm Jacqueline London. Police want to find the four gunmen they say pulled off this well-orchestrated attack. NBC 10's Aaron Baskerville is joining us now from the gas station in Germantown, where this happened. So scary, Aaron. Oh, you said it, Jackie. Awfully frightening, like a scene straight out of a movie. This video certainly catching the attention of anyone who sees it. Right now, we're near Rittenhouse in Wissahickon in Germantown. We talked to a, a whole bunch of drivers out here today. They are definitely cautious and thinking twice about filling up at night. Do you worry about being Yes, I do. Okay, all the time. Startling, ridiculous, and frightening. Some of the words drivers are using after seeing this surveillance video from a gas station near Germantown. For those who didn't see it, we showed them. What do you think about what you're seeing? That's terrible. You see four gunmen hop out of a white minivan on Wissahickon Avenue Saturday night. One jumps on the roof of the car, aiming his gun at the driver running away. Rich Gaines, who says he's always on alert, tells us he often thinks about these violent crimes. For my wife and for my daughter, absolutely, and even for my sons to make sure they remember to lock the door, have the seat belts on. Investigators say the victim was not harmed as he sprinted inside the store for help. So far this year, there have been 1,047 carjackings or attempted carjackings in Philadelphia. That number is dramatically higher compared to the 522 during the same time in 2021. Kathy Dennison tells NBC 10 she was at the gas station that night about 15 minutes before the crime. Do you think twice about filling up at night now? To be honest with you, I didn't want to come here today, <laughs> okay? But like I say, some, it's convenient for me. And it just takes, it takes all the convenience out of your life. She summed it up real good right there. She also says she's constantly looking over her shoulder, looking around at her surroundings. I gave you a few numbers in that story. Here's one more. Last year, in total, in 2021, there were 861 carjackings. With three months still to go here in 2022, we're nearly 200 carjackings above that number. For now, we're live in Germantown. Aaron Baskerville, NBC 10 News.